Hello and welcome to another episode of This is Africa Outdoors. Today we're out here. With sick legals. I'm a little bit sick and we're going to be trying some drop shot and lure fishing in the waves to start off the day. Uh, hopefully we get a big old cobby or maybe a leary, who knows. And later we're going to go for And sure. later we're going to go try catch a mega shark, like an absolute mega shark. Got a new setup, I'm going to test it out, a big old 15 foot. <laughs> Let's see what happens. Let's have a great day. <laughs> Big old bucktail tied on here. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Sun is quite high already, actually. Point is over there. Yeah, over there. Look at the bank. There's a bank there. You, you reckon straight in here? It's not very deep. Hard though. Still on? Yeah. Let me land him for you. Come into it, bring it all the way into the shadow. Uh, uh, what do you think it is? Just keep it thin. Yo! <laughs> Taking a lot of drag. Be careful. Yeah, this is like it. It is! Okay, bring it all the way up like what is that? It's a Mursa cob. Mursa cob. Black out, bro. Well bring it, bring it right into the shallows. It's a nice releasing one. Yeah, we're gonna It's my first cob. Yes, I'm gonna let it go. Yeah, definitely. Regan, just chase it up here. I touch it, Regan. Yeah, don't touch it. It's a good one. Yo, that <laughs> paddle tail is gone, bro. Paddle tail is. Okay, we must keep it in the water, okay? Yeah, yeah, not on the dry side. Yeah, keep it totally in the water. Yes, Dan, stand aside so these things. Let me take a lacquer picture for you. Hey, come, in come. Yeah. Heard me with his first beautiful cob of the day on drop shot. Let's try and get this one out here. Yep, it just pops out like that. Such a beautiful fish, man. Do you want me to take this one? Get it back. <laughs> Yeah, that should be fine. <laughs> yeah, 
Yeah, it should I be good. I think start peeking. There it goes! That is absolutely so sick, dude. Yes. Yo! Just gonna give it a go in the surf, yeah? See what happens. Okay, so now we're gonna go look for bait. Sadly, we did not buy pulchard. We went into the place to buy the pulchard. <laughs> came out with no pulchard, we forgot to get it. Because you're a bright spark, that's okay. You're bright spark. You also went into the shop just as much as me. No, you went and you bought and the And I lost the bucket. Then, <laughs> yeah, so now we have to go look for bait, sadly. Now we have to look for bucket keys first. <laughs> bucket keys first. <laughs> and slops. Surely they should be on the... Oh, and my slops, I left them on the beach and I don't know where they are. <laughs> it's a bad day. <laughs> Show the GoPro. Like, just tickle his butt. Oh, his belly. Like, do this. Wake up. I think we should release it before it dies. He probably got caught by someone. Uh, Josh, have you seen his beak? Mm -mm. Quickly show him his beak. Those things, they cut hooks in half. Oh, that's insane. Cut my finger. Mm -hmm. It's a little bit mm. cuckoo's. Oh no, he's 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 fine. He's getting there. But, uh, ah no, Cobb will probably just destroy him. No, Cobb won't. Cobb knows. They are poisonous, it's poisonous. Or at least they're dangerous. Like okay, eating my bull shot. There he goes. He's happy there. Ah, uh, I don't know. This one looks not like him. He's dazed. He's been out of the water. He'll be fine. Swimming around. Huh. Ach, lekker man. Nice. Actually, never felt sorry for a pufferfish before. So Regan has caught the biggest ever sand prawn in history. That is a big sand prawn. No, Fratch and I got bigger than this, way bigger. Sand prawn? Yeah. That's the biggest sand prawn I've ever seen in my life. Fratch and I can get bigger than this. Dude, up. that thing's snorter. Oh, but I'm joking. That is massive, though. I'm not sure. That pincer is gnarly. Look I'm gonna go try catch my lads, okay? Let's have a couple of throws in here. The tide's going out, so it's not the best time, but you never know. Okay, so we've come to the rocks now, uh, away from the mouth, and we're going to be trying to get some shark bait and also some other edible fish. Might give a few throws with lure in here to start off with and then try for a black tail in this gully. Let's see what happens. Okay, we've extracted some red bait here. It's a weird looking thing. Mm.
Yuck. Okay, got some red bait on here. Okay, so we're going to be trying for some sharks now. Um, we've rigged up our big rods. This is Hodomi's bait over there. This is my big rod over here. And got a big old bait rigged up on a dangle like that. Let's see if we can't get a massive shark. Got a Suragosa 10,000 with a 65 pound braid and a 15 foot blue marlin rod. Um, Hopefully the 10,000 isn't too light for these big fish, but let's give it a go. Let's see what happens. What's happening? Did you get a bite? You're getting a bite? Okay, I'm gonna throw. Is that fine? You get a bite? Yeah. From what? Back to hills? It feels like it. How long are we going to have to wait for? Three hours? That days, yeah. Sure? Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's a ragged tooth shark. Yeah. Here we go, we're on boys. <laughs> oh, pop. Yeah, I need a bit. Small rag, otherwise it's just a drama. We'll pick it up unless it's too short. We'll pick it up again. That's lucky that we're getting bites already. <laughs> Sadly, the SD card got corrupted at this point, but he has an awesome shark that Regan landed. Okay, let's put this in the water. I'll do a waking version now, now when I get my phone. Yeah. Brilliant. Videoing, yep. Okay, guys, we struggled a little bit this morning after the drop shot. We went and pumped prawns, and we got nothing. And eventually, we started throwing, and we had a couple of bites on red baits and prawn. So then we decided to throw for some shots. Here we go. Managed to get a nice smooth down. Whoop. Bumping a bit of water. We're gonna get a quick measurement on him, weight conversion, and then we'll put him back. Need help getting steady. Yeah. We'll put him here on the sand. Based on the water. On the tail there. How many centimeters? Uh, what, fork or recoil or what? Recoil. Wait, give me a little bit. Okay. 99 centimeters length. Awesome. Oh, just, just one meter. Total length is? Let's get the total here. Total length. Wait, you have a little bit stack. 122. Awesome catch, bro. Okay. Let's get it back. We'll get it back quick. Yeah, big dog! <laughs> Where's your rod? <laughs> the question is that. That's first, sick. my first ever smooth down. Gotta get him back now. Go. 
Sick, bro. Sick. Nice stuff. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Thank you all for watching this episode of This Is Africa Outdoors. Today was quite a tough day, but at least we managed to get some fish. Remember, if you enjoyed this video, give it a like. And if you're new to the channel, definitely do consider subscribing and hit that notification bell. Like because he fought no fish. Yes, I came fishing sick. I deserve a like for that much effort. Okay. Give him a, what's a pity like. Yes.